And our series on addiction in America continues today with this guy. You know him from Growing Pains, but did you know Jeremy Miller battled alcoholism? The trick to his recovery, next. They say it's all right. Say it's all right. Have a good time. Cause it's all right. Oh, it's all right. Everybody clap your hands. Well, there's a lot you didn't know about Jeremy Miller from the classic TV show Growing Pains. Like his difficult battle with alcoholism, but thanks to a new two-step treatment called BioCorrects, he has since turned his life around. The actor, doc, the actor and Dr. George Valerius, who treats patients using a recovery program, join us now right here at Fox and Friends. Thanks for being here. Thank you guys Thank for you. having us. Jeremy, when did your problem start? Um, I actually started drinking around the age of four. Um, I mean, it wasn't an all Explain day. Explain that. <laughs> I, I would run around grandma and grandpa's parties after their after their parties, and I'd finish off all the beers. It tasted right. good, and I would just kind of go and go and go till I uh, fell asleep so, or passed out in grandpa's chair. So when we watched you on Growing Pains, did you have a problem? No, I rarely drank then. Um, I was very protected and sheltered by my mom, right. by the people on the show. There was the occasional drink here and there, um, but anytime I was alone or anytime I had access. It, if I did decide to drink, it would just go to excess. How you, bad? Um, pretty much to blackout. I mean, I would just kind of, I never had that off switch. I couldn't, if I got started, it just kind of kept and going. And you could not get sober. You tried for how long? I tried for almost six years. I tried pretty much everything out there and I uh, went to rehab. I did, uh, you know, outpatient programs. I did traditional 12 step. I did pretty much everything. Well, thankfully, your mom had Google. Yeah, if you're telling me, uh, it made a huge difference. She just happened to come across a, a program. It was an implant that had started in Australia. And uh, she said, we might have found what we're looking for. Cue the doctor. Doctor, what did he find in you? Well, what he found is what a lot of people need to find, and that's a medication-assisted treatment. So all credible governmental and medical societies recommend medication-assisted treatment for addiction. It is the new paradigm. It is the standard of care. Most people in our country get inadequate treatment. They only receive the psychosocial behavioral component of recovery, which is absolutely essential and critical, but those first three to six months are, mar are notable for overwhelming, intrusive, constant cravings. That or relapse. Which, which provoke relapse. Right. In so how does cases. this actually work? How does the BioCrex work in terms of the implant? It's, it's put into your body. Where, does it matter what, where and how long does it work? The implant's usually surgically placed a small outpatient procedure, usually 15 minutes under local anesthesia, in usually the in, the, in the right lower quadrant where an appendectomy would be performed. So what does it do? What it, what it is is naltrexone is a medication that's been around and FDA approved for a number of years to treat alcohol and opioid addiction, but it's only been available in the pill form, which never works because addicts aren't compliant with medication. Sure. But it's also in, in much preferably available in the injectable form, but that only lasts about three or four weeks. Okay, so you got the implant mm -hmm. that's biocorrecting right right in your in your lower belly, mm -hmm. all right, and you you had high hopes for it, and in fact. While you were driving home, what happened? We were stuck in traffic, classic LA traffic. Took us about three hours to get home, and my fiance and I had to stop and get gas right about three hour mark. And I ran in, she gave me 20 bucks to pay. I actually blew past the beers, I paid, and I walked out without a second thought. And no I, craving. And I stopped outside the door. How unique was that? It had never happened in 12, 15 years. Right. I mean, literally, I had never walked out empty. So, doctor, handed. what physically is happening? What is this implant? What's it doing? Well, the, the, uh, when, ad when addiction sets in, and it's fascinating because addictions to, to all these different alcohol, drugs, gambling, video games, pornography, they're all mediated by the same physiologic pathways in the brain. And we have medications that can assist in, in decreasing those, though, that drive, Does that seeking, that craving. Does it just block it? It blocks these, the, opioid re the opiate receptors in the brain, which is which then in turn release dopamine. So there's an imbalance in the seeking drive feedback and then the, the prefrontal impulse control. So you just don't crave it? It, it diminishes the cravings yeah. significantly. And that's where people people are tethered to their addiction because of the cravings, and that's why they relapse. So can this, can this work for everyone, and how, how effective is this? It's, it's very effective, and it can work for, it's, it's approved for, for alcohol and opioid addiction. There's some preliminary studies that in higher doses it can be effective for methamphetamines, but it should be always used in conjunction with 
traditional psychosocial behavior. Right. I, I consider you have to change who you're hanging out with, what you're doing, right. and how you react to stress. But but this I, is going to help you. And this uh, assist in that. This is a tool, an instrument to help. AA and working the steps and your counseling be more effective. People can be more present. It penetrates. It, it allows the recovery right. program to be comprehensive. Uh, you're a believer, Jeremy? I wasn't able to hear any of that. Well, going to 12-step, going to meetings, doing rehab, I, I, my brain could not process the info. It really couldn't until I had this done. Then, when I wasn't being bombarded with that craving all the time, it, it started to sink in. Okay, we know a lot of people are going to be going online to look yes. this up. It's pronounced BioCorrect. You spell it this way, B-I-O-C-O-R-R. -R. X. And if people would like more information, it's available online, right? That, that's the company that has developed this program. Um, and then beataddiction.com is another website that okay. tells you where the centers, mm -hmm. where this program is available. Well, Thank hopefully you, you too helped a lot story. of people just now. Thank you very Jeremy, much. Thanks, thanks so much for coming in. Thank you guys for having us. Thank you. Sure is.